All right, folks, welcome back to your boy, Destination Trucker. We got a couple things going on today. First thing is first, we got to go get my son from school, and then we are going to do some other things. So let's get going. Okay, folks, so now we are in the truck, and uh, we're going to head and get my son from school. I just gotta get out of here first. Oh, what did I do? Oh, look, like I put it in park. Okay, there we go. So anyways, like I was saying, we're going to pick up my son, and then we got some things we're gonna go take a look at. So, um, I'll make it a surprise, probably in this video. Um, so. Let's go get him first. Yeah, yeah. Alright folks, so we got my son picked up and now let's head her and There you go. Chocolate milk. I don't have chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. Anyways, chocolate. let's head to where we go. All right, folks, so we just arrived here. Uh, I'm gonna go down and take a look. I see one that's standing out to me. It's pretty sharp, um, kind of like it. I'm just gonna take a quick look at it. See what we can find. That sun is bright and big. Um, this place is crazy, man. It was hard as hell to park here. Hard as freak to park here. A here we Anyways, look at. Uh, I seen this here, a Challenger here. Um, black one, it's a RT. Um, not bad i mean you know it's all right uh i prefer if it was a wide body or something uh, a little more thing i like the red one i do like the red one it's nice um nice view on it what are rims on this huh they are what is this this has got to be i mean a spoiler on it and everything. Uh, well, not the spoiler, but the low trail effects. Is this uh, one of the SRTs? or? It is, it is. It's a Jeep SRT. I knew I knew it had to be an SRT because looking at those tires and rims. Um, it's crazy. Let's go out here and look, see what we got. Um, pretty sure I see... Ford, my trucks. I like the Fords, folks. I do, but uh, 
There's a 2019 uh, Dodge Ram Rebel. <clears throat> Pretty nice. Load of wheels on that. There you go. Good. Pretty sharp. They are. Uh, that's all fully leather interior and everything. They got the, the sunroof in them too, as you can see. Sunroof, all leather interior. Uh, this one actually ain't as nice. Like my brother's, I believe it's all uh, the seats all red in the middle, and it's got the rebel on the the top part there instead of the, like the side arm area. Um, but I mean, it's still it's nice. I mean, there, there's what I like though. I like the big trucks, the big dualies, right? The Ram 3500 heavy duty. I mean, I prefer the the King Ranch Ford, but. It is what it is. Uh, these here Jeeps, uh, I, I don't know, man. I am not sure about them. Uh, they're they're kind of a uh, they're kind of. I like them, but I don't. I don't know. I like the Rubicon. The Rubicon uh, is kind of like a beefier one. You know, like uh, you look at it, the tires are bigger. It's got nicer rims on it. Um, it just looks a little, I don't know, beefier. I like the hood on the front. Right, like it just looks beefier, and then you look at these ones, and well, it's like you know, uh, uh that's kind of plain Jane, uh, not in tour, but then you look at that one, it's like, man, that looks beefed up compared to this one. Um, some nice vehicles, folks. I was hoping to uh, see a couple of Hellcats, but I don't think they have any. Um, you wouldn't buy them here at this here one. You would go to, like, uh, Sherwood Park. Sherwood Park would probably have two Hellcats sitting in their, uh, sitting in their uh, showroom. Um, so anyways, let's keep going. All right, folks, so I'm out of there. I was surprised. So if anybody is looking to go buy a vehicle or look at a vehicle from a Dodge dealership here in Edmonton, Alberta, um, I would suggest go there because nobody came out to talk to me to see what I was doing anything they didn't uh, you know there it was like there was no sales guys uh hitting at their uh parking lot to to see what i was doing and if they could sell me a vehicle uh, i found it very strange but at the same time it is dodge folks everybody's got a dodge today you know like they're they probably every one of their sales guys are probably busy right now that's why i would almost imagine because everybody's buying dodge um I don't know why, but, well, I do in one sense, I know why. Um, people might uh, say, oh, you're, you're Ron or whatever, but uh, if you look, Dodge is the cheapest vehicle to buy. Um, you know, like, I'm not saying that, uh, like, the Rubicon isn't expensive, the, uh, the Rebel isn't expensive. I mean, they're an expensive truck, but if you just go buy a basic Dodge Ram compared to uh, going to buy a Ford or a GMC or a Chev, the, the, like you know, like just a regular Chevy, regular Ford or whatever. Dodge is the cheapest. Um, brand new Dodge Ram, regular Ram is about uh, I think it's thirty two thousand. Uh, I I looked this up because I proved it to my brother, uh, but uh, I looked it up and uh, <laughs> it is uh, it's cheaper. Like a basic model is cheaper than the Ford, Chevy, whatever, right? So that's why people go to Dodge, in my opinion. I'm not saying that the Dodges aren't nice or anything. I'm just stating that, uh, you know, they are the cheapest vehicle out there to buy. Um, and they're nice. You know, like, that's it. So, anyways, uh, we're just heading over here to uh, our favorite store, Walmart. Okay. All right, anyways. She's saying just get one loaf, uh, whatever. Um, I don't know. Is that the bread I get? No, that bread feels different. This is, uh, this is the one. There we go. Nope. Dempsters. Dempsters bread. That's the bread you get at least today. <laughs> I like it because it's always fresh. So that's why I get it. They're over here trying to get cookies. Um, pastries or whatever they're trying to get. Hey, come on, boys. We are going to go with the regular lean green beef. Boom. Put that in there. 
you need to get some of that stuff. Um, and what else do we need? Uh, like, she just takes so long, so I figure I'll just go and do it here and get it done quick. Um, okay, so, anyways, I gotta grab my. Right there. And what else do we need? Just a couple things we need, right? Uh, uh figure this out. Okay, folks, then we are out of there. Uh, it's kind of a chaos spot, man. The um, kids, kids running around, and everybody. Uh, I don't know. Just. That was a little weird, but anyways, we're out of there and we're heading back home now. Uh, if you like this video, give it that thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. We'll see you on the next one.